hey you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel and welcome to another what's in my bag video so i finally got the juicy couture heritage bowler bag i've been wanting this bag since december and i just went ahead and bought it from a reseller on Macari. Since the seller wasn't asking for too much, I just went ahead and bought it off Macari because y'all, I was looking for this for so long and I just never, I just never could find it. So I finally got it and I wore it out today. I got so many compliments on it. I was feeling so cute. I went to Burlington and why did I find the crossbody version of this bag? So I did pick up the crossbody because I was just like, why are you here? Like. Come on, let's go. So yeah, I guess it was just meant for me to have both styles. I'm so happy with this bag. <sighs> I just love this bag so much. I'm so happy with it. And kind of off topic, I've literally had this makeup on for 12 hours. No exaggeration. I did film this makeup look. I filmed that earlier this morning and it's already like almost 10 o'clock at night. So definitely check that video out because yeah, yeah. 12 hours y'all but let's get into the details of this bag i'm pretty sure you guys have seen this bag literally everywhere on tiktok and on here but this is what it looks like it is a little squeaky like y'all hear that it's, it's kind of squeaky but oh well and that's what the bottom of it looks like it does have a cute little zipper pull and then it does have this crossbody that i'm not too crazy about to be honest but it didn't bother me because what i did i just wore it and i just tucked it like in here and carried the handles okay well that's a bad example but you get the idea so i just carried it like that and just tucked the strap around the handles and it worked out fine for me i'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek of how i packed her so this is what it looks like in the inside i'm actually put it this way this is what it looks like in the inside how cute and then as some of you guys may already know, I like to have a little cup to match my bag. So I pulled out this Starbucks tumbler and I think it goes perfect with my bag. Like that is just so cute to me. And now I want to show you guys everything that's in the bag. So don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and come on over here. So now we're going to jump into what's inside the bag, starting off with my phone. I did put this phone case on and I changed my background. Y'all know I like to make my background match. So so I went back to this background and this phone case while I'm using this bag because, you know, it goes cute together. So I have that. Next, I have this little bathroom pouch. I have some pads, panty liners, a band-aid, a shot wipe, some toilet seat covers, just everything that you would need in the bathroom. I had a sanitizer wipe in here, but I actually used it today. And then I also have some little hair ties. I need to put some more sanitizing wipes in here. So I have that and then next I have this this little pouch that I got from Bath and Body Works. It's a cute little gummy bear. Look how cute she is. And then I added this little bear charm that I got from Shein on here. And I actually have a lot of things in here so let's start putting things out. I have my strawberry pound cake body mist from Bath and Body Works. I have some Hello Kitty tissues. My Fenty um, cherry lip oil. This Moschino bubblegum perfume pen that I have been loving. I, I love this so much. I definitely want the full size to that. And then I have my strawberry cake hand cream from Creme Shop and it has a cute little My Melody on it. I thought strawberry cake and strawberry pound cake would go good together because I actually don't have the strawberry pound cake travel size lotion so I just went with that. And then I have the strawberry pound cake lip gloss from Bath & Body Works. I recently picked this up during their $5.95 sale. This is originally like $10 so that was a pretty decent deal. Next, I have my little manicure kit that I got from Dollar Tree. Let me show you guys what it looks like. It comes with some little scissors, little tweezers, a little cuticle tool, and a nail clipper. And it comes in this cute little case from the Dollar Tree. And then I have my little flashlight also from the Dollar Tree. Then I have this Diamond Plumper from Physicians Formula. I've been carrying this around. I love this lip gloss. It's just always good to have. It goes with everything. So I have that. And I have a broken nail in here that needs to go in the trash. 
and that's everything in my little gummy bear pouch it was a little backpack but i cut off the straps and it doesn't look that good honestly <laughs> but it should have just been a pouch i really don't know why they made it a backpack in the first place because it's so small but i cut off the straps and it's just i don't know i need to recut this all this off but whatever so let's put everything back in here that's everything in that little pouch and then on this side I have my wallet and I'm using this wallet from Juicy Couture. I have this cute little butterfly keychain on it and it already comes with this little chain and then it has this little card holder. Let me try to hide my cards. So it comes with this little card holder but it's attached to the chain and then you could put like your cards in here and stuff but I didn't put my cards in there for the purpose of the video because I don't want to show my cards of course. And it has this little zipper pouch in the back for coins and cash. And then this is what it looks like in the inside. It has some card slots and things. And it has a little pocket for cash. So that's my wallet. Next I have this little heart shaped pouch from Juicy Couture. I added this little heart keychain that I got from Shein on here. And let me show you guys what I have inside. So the first thing that I have is this little kit that comes with your press-ons and has like a nail file a cuticle tool and then it has these little nail stickers i figured this is just good to have just in case a nail pops off and for whatever reason my glue isn't working or i lost my glue at least i have some nail stickers next i have these little blotting sheets from the crim shop i've been carrying those and loving them also have this little hello kitty powder puff I got this from Daiso. I've just been carrying this around just in case, but I actually haven't needed it yet. But it's so thin, it doesn't take up any space, so why not just have it in case? I also have my little razors from the Crim Shop. Always good to have just in case. Then I have this little nail glue. This is just the Kiss nail glue that comes with any nails that you get from Kiss. And then since my allergies really don't know how to act, I have some Vicks Vapor Rub. And I also picked up these daytime allergy pills from Rite Aid. And tell me why for 10 pills, it was literally $10. So each of these little pills are a dollar. And I need them because I literally could not stop sneezing and my eyes were watering and it was ruining my makeup. So I literally had to go run into Rite Aid today and just buy me some medication because I could not. I couldn't even do. Next I have my little, ooh, okay. I had to tie this on because my nails are too long for me to push the little thing through the hole. So I just tied it on here. And what we have here is my AirPods, actually Beats Pods, let me come correct. My little Beats Pods. I have my little gummy bear case from Bath & Body Works. And I have a strawberry pound cake pocket back inside. And then I just have these cute little decorations i have my hello kitty plush dangler and then i have this cute little heart that matches everything you know just a cute little moment and thank you guys for being honest with me on my last video and telling me to take this gummy bear off of the bag i don't know what i was thinking but i took it off thanks to you guys next i have this little gummy bear lip smacker I'm trying to remember where I got this from. I actually don't remember where I got this from. I actually got this from Rite Aid on a whole different day, like a while ago. And it has like a little lip balm in the inside. I kind of don't like the concept of taking out the bear's insides. Like that kind of looks, it looks really weird without this, but I really didn't know what to expect when I first got it. I mainly threw this in for aesthetics, but also because Ari always asks for like my lip gloss and my lip balms and things. And this is like a good thing to let her use, so have that and then that is everything in this big compartment of the bag but it does have these little slots up here let me try to show you guys so it does have these little slots up here where i can put things and i do have some things tucked in there i have my summer fridays lip balm i have my hello kitty case it's from Daiso, and i just have some gum inside i actually need to refill this and in the second pouch i just have my silver girl clean fresh gloss and this is the shade Sugar Poppy. 
Next I have some Q-tips because my eyes were watering due to my allergies once again. I need these to be really accessible today so I put them right there instead of having them in here. They were originally in here but I just, y'all I couldn't stop. My eyes just would not stop watering today. And then next I have my little breath spray. That stuff is strong and it really works. And then the last thing I have up there is this little bloom packet. I've been taking bloom. I'm trying to get into it. So I bought these little packets with the different flavors. And this is the berry flavor. So far it's not bad. And I think it does help with like the bloating. Because I get bloated really bad. And that's everything in these two pockets. So I'm going to go ahead and put these little things back. On the other side of this bag, it does have this little zipper pouch. And I usually don't use these little pouches, but I decided to keep my little notepad and pen back there because it's real thin. It doesn't really take up a lot of space. And then I like the fact that this little bow just sticks out of the zipper compartment. So I just have those little two things back there. And that is everything in my bag. Now we're going to put everything back in the bag. My setup is really easy, so I just have my little pouch in the back. And I have this pouch on the side, and then these two on the other side, and then I threw my little keychain thing on the side of my purse because I just didn't like how it looked in the front because it made the purse look a little bulky, so I just did it like that, and then I just threw this in there, and then I put my phone back here. And that is how I set up my bag. I didn't want it to look too stuffed, so that's why I did it this way. Which it kind of does look a little stuffed, but it's not too bad, so it's fine. And that is everything in my bag. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And leave a comment down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video.